Hello, this video provides faculty a quick overview of entering final grades in the Ashford University campus classroom. First, we will begin by selecting view, then filters, and then assignment groups. From here, we will use the all assignment groups drop down box and select final grade, which will filter the grade book. Next, we are going to be moving the total column located at the very end to the front. In order to do this, we're going to be hovering over total, selecting the three dots, and then moving this to the front. When entering final grades, we're going to be using the column right next to it, which is out of 100. You have a couple of options when entering final grades, which you can hover over final grades, select the three dots, and then go down to enter grades as either points, percentage, or grading scheme. I will go ahead and select percentage as the way I'm going to enter final grades here. And I'm going to go ahead and enter what exactly is noted in the total column. You can change the view after you've entered in the final grade, going back to enter grade as points, which will reflect the point value out of 100, or the grading scheme, which will reflect the letter grade the student has earned. Please note when selecting grading scheme and entering the letter grade, which I'll illustrate here, when you go back to change the view to either points or percentage, it's going to reflect a score that's either been rounded up or down. If you have any questions, please contact your Center for Excellence in Teaching and Learning representative. 